happy August 1st. So we know what that means. Arbitrary August. Yes, I got a lid. Cats are jerks and I was figuring one of them would probably run off with one of the culprits right here. Isabella. I feel like I was just filming yesterday because I actually was, but you guys probably won't see this for about a week. So how has everyone been? Uh, it's currently obviously August 1st. It's about 1030 in the morning and I got all my adulting done for the day. Did my workout, did some housework, and yeah, that's about it. And so I have six hours before I have to go to work, so lots of stitching time. So we're gonna pick today's project. Not looking. Okay, so we got Pokemon color eight. I can't read backwards, 824. So I'm gonna work on my Pokemon and work on that color. Um, that color is probably one of the higher numbers. I started with my most colors for that, just so they were bigger chunks so I could see more progress in just one day. Uh, so yeah, I will get that out and we'll see where I'm at and we'll go from there. Okay, so here's where Pokemon is at now. Uh, 824 is a fairly dark color, so I'm not sure how much progress you're gonna see, but we'll see you tomorrow with an update. Good morning everyone, it is August 2nd and I'm here to show you my progress on Pokemon for last night. So as you can see, I did a lot on the Haunch Crow here and a little bit on the Mantine up here. It's a really dark blue and started on the Poliwhirl when I ran out of time. Uh, just to try to keep this down to one clip a day to save my poor computer from processing. I already pulled, I got Butterfly Expressions. Um, this was a Mania start. This is what it will look like when it's done. And then I got some color here and a little bit of the wings done. I think the whole butterfly is blended thread, so this should be really fun to work on today. I wasn't really sure how I was gonna feel if I got a non-full coverage piece. I'm like, oh, I don't wanna work on little stuff, but I pulled it and I was pretty excited, so. We'll get working on that. I also got a little bit of mail today. Uh, I got my last piece of birthday haul, another Fluttershy diamond painting. So my birthday was the end of June, it's the beginning of August, so a little over a month for like seven bucks, so not too bad. I haven't opened it up and checked it all out yet. And, oh look at that, another piece of white fabric. And I got three more being held hostage by the post office with custom fees right now. So I will have more white fabric to show you tomorrow. And by the end of today, more of my computer parts should be showing up. So have a great day. Enjoy your arbitrary August. And we'll see you tomorrow with another update. Good morning, everyone. It is Friday, August 3rd. And I'm here to show you my progress for arbitrary August from yesterday. I worked on... Butterfly Expressions. Uh, as you can see, I got the brown and the white done. Excuse my cats, they're arguing. And for today, I picked Beautiful Bird, another Dimensions kit of a peacock with some Chinese writing. This is a Mania start, so this is everything I have so far. Excuse Bella. All right, well, we'll see you tomorrow for another update. Hey everyone, it is August 4th, almost uh, 9.45 p.m. I just got home from work, ate, showered, all that fun stuff. So this is the progress I got yesterday on Beautiful Bird. Uh, if you remember, I only had the brown done, so I've done everything from there up. So it's coming along nicely. If I really sat down and worked on it, it'd probably only take me a week to finish this whole piece, so I might keep that as a quick finish for later. And today's pick was Bioshock Infinite. Uh, it's a chart I designed myself. Um, this is what it's going to look like when it's done. Well, not exactly, but that's the image it was made from. Um, I'm working out on red fabric so I don't have to stitch all the background. Uh, I'm probably going to work on some black because I decided to start with the black first on this one. And yeah. Let's see how far I get. I'm literally going to toss one stitch into my 100 Days of Hate Challenge and then might work on this for 
15, 20 minutes and then I am off to bed because I have another 12 hour day tomorrow. So we'll see you all tomorrow evening for another update. Bye. Hi everyone. It is Sunday, August 5th. And here's my progress from yesterday on Bioshock Infinite. As you see, um, I was pretty out of it working overtime. So I did the borders all the way up. I finished this little flower up, well, not flower, but corner piece here. And then I started working this way a bit. I got about 300 stitches done. Worked on it for a little over an hour. I did all of one stitch in my head, like I said I was going to. Um, I worked a lot today too, so it's currently quarter after nine. But I don't have to work tomorrow morning, so I might stay up a bit later, might get a little bit more work done on my hay. And today's pattern was seashells. This was a mania start. Um, you won't be able to see much because the only thing I stitched on it has been white so far. But this is the little insert. It's a dimensions kit. I don't know what it's actually called. I call it seashells. Um, but I don't have the name on the chart anywhere. So that's what I have done. I'm probably going to do colors though, just so you guys can see something. So we'll see you in a clip tomorrow morning, bright and early. Have a good one. Good morning everyone, it is about 9.30 on Monday, August 6th. It's civic holiday today here in Canada, so I still have to work, but only for four hours today, so I should have a lot of stitching time. This is the progress I made last night on seashells. The only thing I had done was the white, so all the color I stitched last night. I spent maybe an hour, hour and a half. Ah, Isabella down. Sorry, cat. I'm in my bedroom right now because on my last floss tube, I mentioned I would show someone how big the Middle Earth map is. So, if you haven't guessed, I got my Middle Earth map for today. And that is my queen size bed. So, yeah, it's massive. I think the AA stitch count is 800 and something by 7 something. So it's a little longer than it needs to be, but the width is like the exact perfect amount. This is also approximately the same finish size as Pokemon, and it's a lot easier to work with for smaller pieces than this massive roll. Um, but yeah, we'll see you tomorrow for an update on how far I got. Hey everyone, uh, it is currently August 7th around 9.30 p.m. Just got home from work. This is the progress I made last night on um, Realm of Middle Earth, the map. Uh, I did a lot of 921 kind of up in this area, filling in up in here and then that's the end of the page. Excuse the cats. And then for today I got Alduar. So this is where I am. A lot of black done. So this is the first section that's a big triangle coming in here. So I'm probably gonna work on filling in the black up along here. Uh, it's pretty thick though. It's almost like 12 stitches across. So I'm not sure how much I'm gonna get done, but I am gonna stitch for a few hours tonight and work on my hate a little. Hopefully there's actually enough to show you guys in the next few days of progress on that. But uh, yeah, we'll see you tomorrow with another clip for what I picked tomorrow morning. Hey everyone, it is August 8th. It's a little after one o'clock in the afternoon. Um, didn't work yet today. I worked this afternoon for a few hours. Uh, I spent my morning building a new computer um, with my boyfriend's help. He ordered all the parts about a week and a half ago. Everything showed up last night, so that's what we decided to do this morning together. Hopefully, uh, yeah, there's no reason why I won't be up and running by the weekend. I work... Uh, tomorrow and Friday so while I'm at work he's gonna get everything installed and running so we can play World of Warcraft all weekend together uh, so I got about a hundred stitches done last night worked right here a little bit and I think I did some of this up in there uh, got home late and just completely exhausted and then for today we pulled Final Fantasy 7 so I'll probably just continue on with the skin tones and the rest of these guys. Um, I might even bring it to work and work on it at work since it's so small and I could just bring one color and work on it for about half an hour at work tonight. And then I actually got some progress that's noticeable on my heaven and earth. I don't remember the last time you guys have seen this. But I have been slowly plugging away at it. Um, 
The current color I'm working on now is 921, which is this really dark copper color. So it's actually not confetti at all. It's actually in pretty large chunks, and it's the darkest color at the bottom of each letter. So I'm going to work on that a little bit tonight too. And we'll see you tomorrow night for a really quick update. I work 14 hours tomorrow. And then I gotta be back at work for 7.30 Friday morning. So I'm literally gonna do like 20 stitches total tomorrow night, but progress is progress. And we'll see what gets chosen to be completely neglected. <laughs> we'll see you then, bye. Hey everyone, it's about quarter to 11 on August 9th. This is my progress from yesterday for arbitrary August. Uh, Final Fantasy VII by Clouds Factory. Um, so I think I did these two guys' faces and then started on a face over here. Didn't get much done. Had a very, very long day at work both days. Uh, today's pick was Drive a Stick. It's going to be kind of hard to see. It's on black perforated paper. And I didn't think this through very well. I don't have a good background for it. And this is what it'll look like when it's done. It's one of the Mill Hill bead buttons and bead kits. Uh, so I am literally going to put one stitch in my head, do about 15 minutes on this, and then I am off to bed. So, won't have a lot of progress to show you guys tomorrow, but at least I'm doing something. One stitch is better than none. Have a good night, guys. Hey everyone, it is currently August 10th. It's about 4.30. I just got home from work, got some stuff done, and just getting ready to sit down and stitch for a bit. This is where I got to last night on I Drive a Stick. I didn't even finish off the string. Just hanging. Started in this corner, worked my way across, and worked up a little bit. Uh, I was absolutely exhausted, so I maybe stitched for 10-15 minutes total. That's all I could concentrate on. And since this is going to be my last clip for this video, here is my overall progress on uh, No Smoking. So, you'll be able to see from earlier in the video how much it's filled out. Um, again, ooh, look at that, I left another thread hanging. Uh, I still have to work on this today. I'm going to do another clip later when I start my Arbitrary August piece, uh, once I pick it and get going with that. I'm going to get all this edited together. Hopefully you will see this video tonight or tomorrow, or whenever you catch up with your Floss Tube backlog. And uh, yeah, hope you guys have a great stitchy weekend this weekend, and we'll see you for an update in a bit.